we're here at Euro Satori 2018, and I'm talking to Tomas Minacic, Director, Defence Programmes for Tatra. We're standing beside an example of Excalibur Army's Patriot Light Armoured Vehicle. That's fitted with Tatra's tubular backbone and swinging half-axle suspension system, a product that has been around for a number of years now. Thomas, could you tell us a little bit about that suspension system, some of the current applications for it, and, and anything that may be emerging in the near future? Yes, sure. Uh, so, uh, at first, I would like to uh, mention that uh, Tatra is primarily independent supplier of the mobility for many different kinds of applications for civilian defense and special uh, purpose vehicles that are built by our local partners worldwide. So, for example, uh, this vehicle, Patriot, is a good example of it. Uh, this Patriot vehicle, it basically, it is an armored uh, uh, tactical 12-ton vehicle that is built on 4x4 Tatra chassis. So, uh, the Tatra chassis, as you mentioned, uh, it's based on uh, the uh, tubes and uh, independent swinging half axles. Uh, that basically gives uh, the vehicle very special and unique uh, uh, features. Now, I, th I think most people will be aware that, that the, the tubular backbone chassis frame with its swinging half axles fitted to a huge variety of Tatra's tactical and commercial trucks. It can also be seen on products like uh, the Titus by Nexta, uh, a couple of products in Jordan and, and I believe Avibras use it for Astros. Mm -hmm. um, is there anything that people may not necessarily be aware of that uses that, that chassis frame setup? Yes, uh, we have a brand new product which is a Tatra trailer. This is a 18 tons uh, trailer utilizing tandem axles, basically two axles, uh, based uh, on a Tatra chassis conception. Uh, the trailer is really unique because this is the first time when the trailer is not a limit for tractor unit anymore in terms of uh, mobility and speed, but now the tractor unit is a limit for the uh, trailer. Are there any uh, competitions uh, ongoing or pending that that trailer is being proposed for? Uh, well, right now we are bidding uh, in a big uh, US tender for the trailers. So, uh, and I can also tell that uh, the trailer is fully homologated for the use in uh, European roads, public roads. So, uh, that's, uh, that's our trailer. And, and the suspension system on the trailer, because on, on, on military trucks, commercial trucks, armoured vehicles, there are a selection of options. You can have, uh, as I understand it, leaf springs, airbags, leaf springs in combination with airbags. Mm -hmm. What setup does the trailer have? Okay, so speaking about the trailer, uh, there are, as I mentioned, tandem axles uh, and the payload uh, on the axles is uh, up to 18 tons, which means that uh, uh, the trailer itself, the, the weight of the trailer is 5 tons and it can, you can load uh, up to 13 tons on it. I'll throw one final question in your direction. Um, there is one vehicle in Tatra's portfolio that does not feature the tubular backbone chassis and I believe that's now called the Tatra Tactic. Is that still available? Yes, it is available. Uh, this is from uh, T810 family. Uh, this is the only model that it's not utilizing um, uh, swinging off axles and, and tubes, but um, uh, it has uh, rigid axles. Uh, the vehicle is characteristic for its uh, high ground clearance and uh, uh, we supply plenty of them uh, to the Czech Army in the last couple of years. Uh, and if I recall correctly, in keeping with, with Tatra's emphasis on mobility, those rigid axles fitted to the tactic are of portal type and are Tatra's own product? Yes, of course. Excellent. Thank you very much indeed.